Good morning, Hughley family, and welcome to the Monday Morning Two Minute Drill. Today's word is brought to you by the letter F for freedom. Recently, I had this uh, great opportunity for the very first time to go to Washington, D.C. And while I was there, I saw all of the touristy things. I saw the White House, but it really wasn't that big. It was kind of a failure, like a dud for me, but it was exciting still. But the one thing that I saw that really took my breath away was when I went to the Lincoln Memorial. It was absolutely amazing. When I saw it and I stood in there and I read the words, something hit me. In one of his speeches, to paraphrase it, he pretty much says that in order to have peace and a perfect union, we must go to war. Now I understand it's 4th of July and we went to war against the British so we could have independence and freedom. But Lincoln also had to go to war for the ultimate freedom in this country. And we had to war against ourselves. I thought about that. How many times that we have to look within ourselves to figure out what's going on in ourselves in order to have the peace we ultimately want. Now we know that Christ gives the peace that passes all understanding. We understand that certain things need to take place, but what we don't sometimes recognize is the fact that we must go to war, maybe within ourselves. That we must face and confront some of the things that need to be improved, need to be better. Some of the things that we just need to wrestle with. And in that war, and in that battle, at the end, we shall find freedom. The Bible says that whom the Son sets free, he is free indeed. But I don't think that doesn't come without a fight. So this month, as we celebrate our freedom, as we celebrate independence, let's take a time to reflect and look within ourselves to find out what it is that we need to go to war with, that we need to battle with, so that we can have internal freedom and internal peace for an internal perfect union. And on that note, blessings.